Hello, welcome to GP channel. Today we would like to cook chicken spaghetti. In our cooking process today, we would like to divide it into two process. The first stage is to make to boil spaghetti and then the second is to make the spaghetti sauce. But first we would like to prepare the ingredient as shown in this video. We put hot water into the pan and afterwards we just put a little vegetable oil into the water so that the spaghetti noodles will not stick each other when they are boiling and then the afterwards we put salt just a little bit to make the spaghetti noodle tester after the water is hot enough and then we boil the spaghetti I prefer to cut spaghetti into two parts so it can be put into the pan but it's up to you if you have a bigger pan then you just keep it long enough So when the spaghetti already in the water, we just close it and then let it boil for about 10 minutes. So we see how the spaghetti going on and then it looks like the spaghetti already well boiled, then it's finished. So what we are gonna do is we just separate the spaghetti and the water. Just pour the water and then make sure that they already separate with the water. So that's it. The first stage of making spaghetti finish. The second part of this process is to make the spaghetti sauce. First, we put the vegetable oils into the pan and afterwards we fry, stir fry the chicken. So this chicken should be in a very small chop or also we can call it as like a smash chicken. We cook the shallot we still fry the garlic Just keep the pan closed for some minutes to make sure that the chicken is well cooked. After they are well cooked, and then we put the mushroom into the pan and mix together with the chicken meat and then we add chili but chili is an optional if you like the uh, hot uh, 
spaghetti chicken, you can add chili, but if you like not hot spaghetti chicken, then you don't need to, it's necessary to put chili on it. You just pour salt. Add, add pepper and I prefer to add some more salty soya sauce to get more flavor on the spaghetti sauce and just keep it for some minutes so the mushroom can be softer and well cooked. Since the mushroom is already softer, then we pour the tomato sauce. And you can also add some more water. I also prefer to put some big milk flote, just like this. So just keep it for some minutes. So that the tomatoes sauce can be well cooked. And then we see how our cooking spaghetti sauce look like. And since that all ingredients already well mixed. And before I usually add the sheaf. We Add some more cheese at the end of our process so the cheese can make the ingredients condense. So just keep. this for some other minutes so it looks like now the spaghetti sauce is ready then we just turn off the electricity and then that's it now we have Two part. The first part is spaghetti itself, and the second part is spaghetti sauce. And now it's a dressing time. So we put spaghetti on the plate just like this. Afterwards, we pour the spaghetti sauce. So all spaghetti sauce make sure it's cover and enough for this one plate. And afterwards 
we add cheese on the top of the spaghetti. So we also can put Thai mint on the top of the cheese itself. So, so we can also add chips for sweet decorations just like this. Thank you for watching GP channel. Please subscribe to GP channel. Hope to see you next time in the next video. Goodbye.